Hello everyone, uh, welcome to Amanda Adams Auctions Overview. This is for the auction coming up on Monday night, the 8th of January. So we're going to put this up early. Uh, this is before Christmas, so we're finishing off our January auction now. Uh, just like to go around and give you an overview. I'm doing this on my own again, so I uh, hope you enjoy it. And uh, if you watch this before Christmas and New Year, have a great Christmas and New Year. And we'll see you on Monday the 8th of January at 6.30. The viewing will be on uh, Saturday the 6th, 11am to 4pm. And on Monday the 8th, uh, 12 noon to 6pm. Look forward to seeing you. I'll just walk around, give you an overview of what's in the auction. Um, a lot of good artwork in this auction from a very good collection from Caulfield. Uh, Dennis Roper. Along there, we've got uh, Arthur Boyd, Sid Nolans. Um, over this way, uh, one of my favourites is the uh, Yossel Bergner Big Oil. This is painted in 1989. It's come from a, a very well-known collection. And there's also, uh, he's a, the collector is a historian and he works as a lecturer and an author as well. So a very well-known collection. Walk around this way. A lot of um, interesting uh, Jewish artworks from uh, the early part of the 20th century. Along there, it's a Will Dyson. You can see that there. Um, along this way, lots of interesting works. Oh, this really nice uh, little Septimus Power came in. Early one. Uh, from an estate in East Q. Beautiful work. Louise Fortham. Beautiful work from about 2010. More artwork here. Lots of artwork. The room is absolutely chock a book, uh, block full. I've got to show you, uh, if you're into traditional, there's a, a stunning work by Ernest Buckmaster from, uh, I think, the. 50s or early 60s let's have a look there it is oh, yeah, early 60s 63 lots of rare la leak in the auction and lots of uh good murano glass oh, look at that stunning decanter hopefully you can see it there just amazing decanters come in also uh, a rare vase there all 30s la leak figurines I walk past this one. This is I love this. The little uh, Murano head, artist piece, individual piece. More art glass. Satsuma. Lots of good uh, estate jewelry in the auction as well. And look at this. This is stunning. Uh, spode hand painted spode vase. And there's a bit of Australian pottery as well. Uh, in the furniture side of it, some really great retro pieces. Herman Miller chairs along there. A couple of Herman Miller chairs. A Cassini chairs, there's two of them. That one there. And this one here from the 80s. Beautiful chair, rare chair. Along this way, we'll walk around as well. See some more furniture, some Georgian furniture. Little Georgian side tables. Last auction we had a lot of uh, pieces of Georgian. And this is it's interesting. We have two lots in over two auctions. Love that little side table. Beautiful work in any modern uh, apartment or modern home as well. And this is, this is good. A rare piece of uh, 19th century French buhl. And it's interesting, this has come from the same estate where the Buckmasters come in. Have a look at this. Full provenance when they purchased it in the 50s. I don't know if you can see that. See if I can adjust it. There you go. Come from Scotland. Beautiful piece. Needs a little bit of work, but because it's 100% genuine, hasn't been played around with, it's worth spending money on this one look fantastic in the right house over here we'll go around this way massive big Edwardian sideboard here we are some nice hand painted plates 
The rooms are chock-a-block full. Absolutely chock-a-block full. Oh, hello. Okay, some nice sofas. Lots of silver in this auction as well. A lot of good sterling silver. Uh, and European silver and Mexican silver. Can you see in there? Have a look. Looks fantastic. More good pieces in here. Good watches as well. So the rooms have got a very interesting eclectic uh, feel about them. Lots of different things. Something for everyone. Beautiful uh, cedar Dickens desk. Have another swing around this way. We'll come around the front and just give you a last little look. What else is in the auction? Beautiful Japanese uh, uh, 19th century dowry chest. And there's a, a really interesting Biedermeyer European ch uh, chest of drawers. So there we go. That gives you a good overview of what's in here. And it shows you it's definitely worth coming in. It's going to be early. We're one of the first auctions on for the year in Melbourne. The auction again, reminder, is on January the 8th. And hopefully we see you in, uh, then when you're back from holidays. And we look uh, forward to seeing you in 2018. And all the best for the new year. Well, bye. Bye.